Monster X's member Mean Hyuk has officially enlisted in the military. On March 13th, he had shared his enlistment date himself through a handwritten letter to fans, telling them that he would be enlisting on April 4th. A few weeks after that initial announcement, he gave another update to fans by showing his shaved hair in his social media. In the pictures, Mean Hyuk can be seen sporting a buzz cut and posing with fellow member Ki Hyun. Netizens praised him for his handsome visuals, commenting, how can he look so handsome despite having a buzz cut? Mean Hyuk isn't the only one in enlisting, as God 7s Jin Young will also be enlisting for his mandatory military service as an active duty soldier on May 8th, as confirmed by his agency, BH Entertainment. Jin Young wrote a letter to fans saying that they must have been surprised after seeing the news of his enlistment. He also told fans that they shouldn't be worried, and in return, they wished him good health and a fast return. AD Entertainment, only one of his agency, has announced that they would be taking strong legal action against the rumors that have been spreading around about the group. But what is this in relation to. The whole K-pop world was shocked on April 3rd when it was confirmed that a member of a six-member male idol group was facing trial for inappropriately hurting another member of the group when the two were trainees and after they debuted. Seoul newspaper reported that the perpetrator was accused of touching the member's body at least three times in the dorm and practice room from 2017 to 2021 without his consent. It was also said that the idol admitted to most charges but claimed that he was too drunk to remember some of the events. He also left left the group for personal reasons after the incident. The perpetrator's identity won't be disclosed until the trial is over, but people have already started making speculation about who he might be. One of the group names that came up way too often was that of Only One Of. They're a six-member group and had a member leave in 2021, which led people to think that they might be the group in question. But AD Entertainment managed to address and shut down the rumors before they spread further. On the day the news about the unknown idol came out, the agency released an official statement on only one of Twitter account to deny that the group were associated with the recent news article. They went on, In the case that we later continue to discover false information regarding only one of, we announced that we will respond strongly with strict legal action. This is why it's really important not to make speculations about cases like this. Knowing that the victim is from the same group too, if the perpetrator's identity gets disclosed, so will the victim, so people really should be careful. Taemin is finally coming back. On April 4th, he completed his two year military service and was officially discharged almost two years after his enlistment for active duty on April 19th, 2021. To celebrate this occasion, SM Entertainment released a video titled Taemin is Back, which included archived footage of him practicing in a room. Taemin also released a handwritten letter to share with fans his feelings during his time in the military and about being discharged. He wrote, I missed you so much that even saying I miss you is not enough, and I believe everyone who believed in me and waited for me must have felt the same way as I did. Taemin also proved that he wastes no time as he got back to work immediately. Based on an April 5th announcement, later this month, Taemin will hold a two-day solo fan meeting event at the Kyunghee University Peace Hall in Seoul, more specifically on April 22nd and 23rd. To make things even better, according to the release schedule shared by SM Entertainment in February, Shiny is anticipating to make a comeback as a full group in May. This release will be their first since the repackaged album Atlantis in April 2021, and we really can't wait to see them all back on the stage again. Taemin's return didn't go all that smoothly because netizens will always find something to complain about and criticize. After being discharged, Taemin held a live stream on his Instagram account to chat with fans properly for the first time in a while. In the Instagram live he did on April 4th, he shared that he had finally dyed his hair for the first time in two years so he could show his fans a different look. He also said that he had the opportunity to reflect on himself and cherish all the memories that he shared with the fans. During the live show, fans noticed Taemin's fuller figure. Taemin had also mentioned the fact that he had gained weight in an interview with the Military Manpower Administration in October 2021, but of course, you can't expect netizens to be normal about things like this, going as far as to accuse Taemin of getting fillers as he looked unrecognizable. A Nate Pan Online community user took some screenshots from the live show and posted them with the title, Did Taemin Get Fillers in His Face? They also added the caption, Those are the screen caps from today's live live stream, and why is his face like this? There was a viral tweet about it. Why is his face so puffy? I feel like even the natural Onyu looks better. Some fans jumped to his defense right away, saying that Taemin probably just gained weight and his face got fuller, but others mocked his appearance, writing, The fans' shields are solid. If an A-list male idol looked like that, he'd get hated to no end. And if you didn't write his name, I wouldn't have been able to recognize him. Which is a totally unnecessary exaggeration, especially considering that he looks the 
the exact same. One also claimed that Paimin had gained weight because he wasn't taking care of himself. A lot are wondering how netizens could be so cruel considering that Taemin just came back. Another commenter said, Imagine just returning and people already are being nasty. He gained weight, especially on his face, and even talked about it. Gosh, people are rude. The man hasn't even been out for a full week and they're already on his neck, making nasty comments about his appearance when it's completely unnecessary. I really wish that he didn't see these comments because he's already been through a lot and doesn't need to see these people project their insecurities on him. For the fans that were hoping that Blackpink would leave YG Entertainment for other companies, you might want to be prepared for some bad news, as all the members are expected to renew their contracts. Star News released an exclusive report on April 4th saying that all the members are certainly renewing their exclusive contracts with YG. This report came after insiders who have been working closely with them have shared that the four members are very set on staying in YG. Well, that is, unless an exceptional circumstance comes up that would make them change their decision. The report states that if the members had any thoughts about leaving, their decision to stay was significantly influenced by their extensive world tour and other forthcoming performances. However, the amount of money that YG is allegedly offering the members to renew their contracts might have played a role in their decision as well. Another industry insider reported a few months ago that YG Entertainment is going to offer astronomical down payment for the members to continue promoting with the company. It has been said that YG is predicted to have to offer more than $16 million to every member to make sure that they're going to be renewing their contracts, even though other companies are allegedly offering more. Some fans were really not happy about this, especially since Blackpink are one of the groups with the longest hiatuses and shortest promotions when it comes to releasing music. A commenter sarcastically wrote, Looking forward to more years of no promotions from YG and Teddy re-recording the same song for the fifth time. Another complained, As much as I love YG with Blackpink, we can't keep getting musically starved. There are some fans that don't even believe the report. Seeing as YG also strongly denied that Bobby was leaving Icon when his contract was expiring and he still left, along with the rest of the Icon members, fans think that they might be doing the same thing for Blackpink. You don't want to confirm the possibility that you might be losing your biggest moneymaker, right? Just like Hybes' stocks dropped when BTS announced their hiatus and people thought that they might disband, YG Entertainment can't disclose what's about to happen to Blackpink in fear of having the same thing happen to them. It would be naive to think that they wouldn't be affected if the Blackpink members left. Other fans argued that maybe the girls negotiated better terms with this new contract, including more freedom when it comes to their music and more frequent releases. That and the fact that they have so many things planned for the next few months are really just proving the fact that the members will be renewing. A fan argued, they're on a world tour headlining the biggest festivals. They're the biggest girl group right now. They're planning to launch a new game with an OST and everything. It would make no sense for them to disband. YG Entertainment has yet to confirm or deny the news, but we'll be waiting for a statement, so make sure to stay tuned. Tell me your thoughts in the comments, and make sure to tune in on our next video for more news and updates. Bye!